Hello, this is Andrew with Hamilton's RV in Saginaw, Michigan. Thank you for watching another demo video by Andrew's RV Showcase. Today we have a brand new model to StarCraft. It's going to be the uh, Superlight Max. The model is the 17BH. Um, this just came out and this is the first one we got on the lot. So let's walk around and take a look at some of the options. On the front we got a power tongue jack makes it easier to lift up and down you don't got to crank it this one has two 30 pound propane tanks um, so you got a lot more propane capacity so you don't have to refill them as much let's move around to the side here this is your pass-through storage this one comes with a griddle that mounts on the back there's a um, bracket back there we can take a look at that this is the griddle right here and then there's a bracket right there um, you had a light in here, and this is your solar panel controller. This one's already equipped with the um, solar panel on the roof, um, so you don't need to worry about that. Um, this one is prepped with um, for side view cameras and rear view camera. This one has the upgraded Moride steps, um, nice solid steps that go all the way to the ground. Nice oversized grab handle, outdoor speakers, your electric awning, um, your LED light bar that runs the whole length of the awning here. You have the um, bigger tires on this one to give you a little more ground clearance. This particular, these super light maxes are more geared towards um, off the grid camping, um, but you can still use them for any kind of camping. Let's move around the back. Here is that bracket I was talking about that the griddle will mount to. You just pull that pin and it'll swing out. And then you connect your propane right down here. Uh, as you can see right there, yep. Oh, you got a roof ladder. Makes it easier to get up there. There's your backup observation camera prep right there. And then I, can, I don't know if you can see it. I think you got a good shot of it back up here you actually have luggage racks up there to put um, different things so it's nice when they give you that option so you can carry more things with you you have a full-size spare tire so you're not messing around with a, a donut um, these extra storage doors are always nice um, if you see it goes right into the bunk uh, bunk beds but you can lift this bunk bed up so you can get quite a bit more storage in here you can put bike or coolers or what have you back here these come in handy adds a lot of storage to the unit for putting in things like that move around the side looks like you have your power connection here you got your docking station right here you got your outdoor shower your city water your tank flush and there's kind of the schematic they give you to help you um, figure out where to put the valve and what is what on here Here is the other side of the pass-through storage. And then you got your power cord here, your crank, and then you got a, um, a hose for uh, connecting to the hose connection on here. Here is your switch for the front. Turns these lights on. Makes it look pretty cool. Just some accent lights. All right, let's step inside here. Okay, first right when you walk in, right straight forward, you got your dinette that folds down to a bed. You have your master bed right here. You got a curtain that comes across so you can separate from everything else. Um, you got a hideaway outlet. You got USB chargers and outlet there. You can drop that down and kind of hides away. There's where your TV goes. You have all your wires there. Connecting you got your uh, storage above the bed here Quite a bit of storage You got a window on this side of the bed real good size window by the dinette Over here you got your high-rise faucet and Your sink High-rise faucet makes it easier to get big pans in there here. You got your two burner um, stovetop 
And then up here you got your convection microwave. Which is nice because it saves you room from having to put an oven in here. And as you can see, instead of an oven, they got extra storage. Which you're kind of utilizing all their space in this unit. A little bit of storage here above the sink. You got your gas electric fridge. There, fridge and freezer. So actually very good size fridge for this small of a camper. A lot of times they'll put some pretty small fridges in these campers, but this one is nice and big. Here are your bunks. One there, you have a lower one, and then even when you got the bunk folded down, you still have storage underneath, which is nice. Um, you have the curtain that closes them off. Um, on each bunk you have an outlet, um, a storage spot, and USB chargers. Um, you got a light right there. And same thing down here, you got a light, USB, outlet, and a storage area. Let's take a look in the bathroom. You got your toilet right here. Your sink, uh, countertop space, which that's a good amount of countertop space for this small of a trailer. Storage below. Then you got the uh, medicine cabinet above, which this one, you got a lot of storage in this one. Two, two sides. You got your GFC outlet right there, GFCI. And you got a pretty good size shower here. Definitely for being a small trailer, this is a great size shower. So wine, you got a skylight there. Up there is your fan. I think that's all I have for you on this one. Um, as always, send me a message if you have any questions, if you'd like a more detailed demo video. Just let me know. Thank you for watching.